Absolutely. All right, let's get you started this morning. We're talking about coffee and trying to warm up because it's been so cold. But I love these views as you're maybe waking up, sitting on the patio, drinking your coffee. You might see something like this. Dro Miller sent me a picture of a rainbow in San Anselmo yesterday on Twitter, and you can tag me in your weather pictures. We want to see what's going on all around the Bay Area, and we're going to have, of course, more rainbows, more rain in the forecast over the next few days. As of round now, it's been pretty spotty as we track the activity with Storm Ranger, just seeing a little bit of rain here and there moving across parts of the peninsula, as well as into the East Bay and a couple of spotty showers in the North Bay as well. But we're still in this active weather pattern with this area of low pressure spinning farther off towards the north and west of here. We can continue to see more rain as we go into the next couple of days, but it looks like at least for us today, it's more off than it is on and we'll see another round of wet weather during the overnight hours between tonight and early tomorrow quickly sweeping through but before sunrise it looks like it's in and out of here and the rest of tomorrow is clear and then we get ready for a bigger storm set to arrive later this week with heavy rain and gusty winds there's also the enhanced risk of localized flooding for the weekend and more storms into next week increasing that flood risk in fact this looks to tap into some deep subtropical moisture and that could mean an atmospheric river for us and the series of what could be several more going into the next couple of weeks, but it begins on Thursday and a Friday, more lingering showers on Saturday and not much of a break before more heavy rain comes in on next Tuesday. And some of our models are showing already the potential of an extreme rain event and the possibility of about six to seven inches of rainfall in the North Bay and at least about three to four inches of rain for much of the rest of the Bay Area. So you want to keep checking back in for those updates as we could see this really having a big impact over the next several days. And our temperatures only just get slightly milder going into next week, low 60s on Monday.